looking a lot cleaner and brighter and then we'll tidy up the rest of it in the spring I'll do some jet washing and some painting so a car has smashed into the barrier today how do people do this it's quite a wide enough road to get a car through it's obviously a car because they've left part of their bumper lights which is all smashed they've wrecked all this barrier again they're forever repairing these blooming things yeah i can do are you ready to go Okay, I'm just filming this, this mess. And if the barriers weren't there, that would have been our house. Look at this, this black, smashed black glass everywhere. This happened this morning and Tony the paint heard it. We didn't. It must have been fairly early this morning. But Hello. Right. Look, that's tiny paint behind you. They're going to the tip. <laughs> <laughs> Adam! Why can't we stand back and get a proper, a proper look? Anyway, it's much too wide for Tracy's kitchen. We'll take up half of your room. <laughs> My nan had a cupboard like that. <laughs> I think it's like a little drinks cupboard. It's even got little casters on it. Oh. Right. Wow. We do Wheel of Fortune. <laughs> this is not the best. Oh. I want a cupboard like this. I like that one. Oh, I like that choice, don't you? No, no. You don't like it? No, it looks too 1940 to me. No, it's not. No, I don't like it. Oh. But this is the sort of one I'm going to put my place and my captain yeah. in here. But to do be able to do something. Right. That's not this far out, right? but be able to do something. Right, okay, so you want probably narrow, narrower shelves. Yeah, like a Welsh type dressing yeah. room, yeah. Like Where you just got thin shelves for your plates. Yeah. But I can't like that one, is there a price on it? No. On the side, maybe? No. Yeah. Oh, I'm sold. Oh, I like that. It's sold. Don't tell me Stephanie's been here. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised. Jumper. Oh. Yeah. It's very damp. Very damp, but yeah, I love the shape of it. Wow, look at all these worktops. What? You need worktop, don't you? Yeah, not until I know what I'm having, though. Right, well, they've got a grey slaty looking. No, we're doing two bedrooms first. Oh, and the old way, but I mean, if it's for nothing, Trace. <laughs> Oh, look at all these chairs everywhere. They've all got these basket seats, though. <laughs> and look, there's one of those tables, look. Remember we looked... We watched Stephanie's video, didn't we? Look at that. Oh, yeah. That's very, very similar. And again, it looks like it pulls out. It extends. Oh. Yeah. Again, it's probably not a lot of money. <laughs> Look at the detail on it. Trace, it's lovely. Look, the seat is... Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's fine. Mm. There's nothing wrong with that. Sit on it. Yeah, try are. sitting on it. <laughs> Ready? You can all laugh when it breaks. <sighs> No, but I actually quite like the yeah. style of them. Yeah. yeah, it's not. It wouldn't go around my table. <laughs> Look at the legs on them. 
I'll tell you what, if Stephanie was here, she'd buy them to go with those yellow sofas. Oh. <laughs> oh, Only joking. Yeah. <laughs> it hasn't got a price on it. Hang on. Oh, no, the arm's a bit... The arm's a little bit wobbly. But it's just such a pretty shape. Pounds. 15, I think. Wait, okay. Chiffon. Okay. Hey, I'll see you in all the shades. The springs are good. There you yeah. go then, all yours. Oi! Get on! <laughs> Look, 600 euros they've got on that one. That's beautiful, but... It's too big. It's too tall, isn't it? Oh, no, it is lovely. Isn't it? Plates. Yeah. Mm. It's beautiful, Chase. That actually isn't a bad price, 300, because look at the quality of that. Yeah. That is lovely. Can't you but blokes don't see. This is why I do the interiors and Tony just does all the, the hard work. <laughs> oh, yeah. See, I, I can get wardrobes from other places and they're always too expensive at this one. What about something like that, Trace? No. Oh, I thought it was quite narrow. No, it's not that. I just want that I like the style of it. It's not super old. I do like the style of it. And the mirror. I love the mirror. How much for 360? See so again. Oh. It's actually fairly new, I think. But it's gorgeous. Such a useful piece of furniture. Right. Oh. Look at that clock. Well, even that, I think, would be too tall for yours. Oh, look. It's lovely. Uh, it's only 100. See, see, silly prices for wardrobes. I know. And then 110 euros for something that's really interesting. I know it's probably, it's not the hugest, greatest quality, and it probably doesn't work. <laughs> it's lovely. I think it's really pretty. That is very, see, see this? Yeah. See these metal things? Yeah. See the style of and the beautiful mirror? Yeah. How close is that to my one, except it doesn't have the curved doors and that is 800 euros yeah, yeah. I paid 200 pounds including the bed and the little chair that's the price difference in here curtains oh fabrics now Vintagey, some of them. That's rather nice. Two meters by five meters, that's twenty five euros. Do we know what you think? Yeah. Is it not for that is lovely. Story? Yeah, I do like that. It's 25 euros, but it's a nice piece of fabric. Is there enough for? It's two meters by five meters. So it's 10 square meters. Well, I think that's what it says. Let me just check. Two, two meters by five meters. Mm. Which means it's about two pound fifty a meter. For instance, those two chairs I've just bought. Yeah. That's nice. That's pretty. Or, yeah. Or a chair and some curtains, maybe. Lovely. Yeah, I think I prefer it that yeah, way. Yeah, yeah. Right. Definitely having that one. Most certainly is. Yeah, look. Yeah. I've got to... Oh, sorry, but there's quite a lot of it. 
a bit of blanket. Oh, here we are. 18 euros. Yeah, it's almost like a blanket, but it's quite thick. Like the curtains or quite knitted fabric almost. But that would be cushions or curtains. It's not suitable for my house, but it's 1.5 metres by 2.8 metres. So about four square metres for 18 euros. Where do you find that, that style of fabric? Oh, I love that colour. How much is that? One euro for two and a half metres. Right, I'm going to have some of that. I love the colour. Yeah, and that bit's a bit shorter. 50, one metre, 20. Yeah, I'm going to have all of that. Genius for pennies, I can put that on my lampshade. Yeah. Oh, we're getting all excited now over a bit of frilly stuff. <laughs> That's a beautiful piece of furniture. 350. There's a beautiful display cupboard here. And this is 100 euros. In very very good condition. Um, it matches up with this sideboard. Well, I'm not so keen on that, but it's quite an impressive piece of furniture. The sideboard is 170. I mean, it's got a few marks on the top of it. A few, not quite splits, but. But for some reason it's got a strange square that is a different colour so I'm presuming that something has been sitting on there for a long time and the rest has faded but it's oh it's got a little drinks cupboard it's in very good condition it's not old but I'm presuming it goes with this table as well now the table is 150 including the chairs, but the chairs are quite worn although if you really had to set it, it would be worth doing it's very elegant I wouldn't say it's no, it's not old, it's not an antique but if it's your style of furniture it's a very good buy so you've got six chairs, table for 150 sideboard for 170 That's 320 and display cabinet for another 100 so 420 euros must have cost a fortune when it was new detail but yeah amazing what you find in here 160 that's not their right price, so that's what they were they were up for 160 euros I don't know anything about um, design, but they're leather, obviously. Yeah, they are, they? But they're too small, are they, Chelsea? Uh, I can't bother trying on. They might oh. be on, but it's just... Okay. But, yeah, the, you've got the prices on the box, so where did it actually... I've got a box. Oh, but you can see from the boxes, we've got €20, Euros 25. That label's been taken off. Oh. Yeah, it ain't going to fit anyway. I These ones were €90, Euros, they're now 20 so... I would think that's going to be about 30 for that pair of boots. I don't know, a pair of rugs there. Is there? What size? Size one. Oh, tiny. I don't know. Yeah, because I'd like a pair of those. <laughs> yeah, they're all dinky. Yeah, they are. Uh, I'll need some flat boots, but none of these are big enough for me. They don't seem to have sh decent sized shoes in France. Most places they seem to stop at a seven, which is the biggest. Yeah, this is 37. That's about six, is it? 37? No, I've 37 before. Yeah, no. Is it really? Yeah, I've got 37. Oh, right. Yeah, very small. Oh, way too small for me. Unfortunately, I've got big feet. Hmm. Anyway. Yep. Oh, no, Never mind. Now, here's a really, an example of really what not to do to one of those beautiful tables. Someone's painted it, and I hate it. 
I know the brown furniture's not really in, but could have done a better job than that. Anyway. Where do we start? <laughs> Wow. So many to choose from. <laughs> there are a few things here, obviously, that are still here. There's so much of it. No. Oh. I thought that was part of the same set as those little plates. <laughs> With the bird and the twig, it looks very similar. It's all broken. Oh, it's actually stapled together. Somebody thought it was worth saving. And it actually says HB. I can't read that, but it says HB. I might have a close look when I get home if I can read that. That's 15 euros. If it was part of that same set, I probably would have bought it even with the damage. But yeah, it did look very familiar. The old ones are rather pretty, there's only two. And again, I can't read it. Well, I've taken down the partition, didn't used to be able to see through this bit. <laughs> The oh, I can't read the rest, and there's only two. Lots of saucers. Only two cups, and one little, what looks like a sugar bar. Oh, shame, really pretty. Oh, these are cute. But again, it comes as a whole set, I just want a little set of coffee cups. I can't read that, I can't even see if it's the right way up. Again, that's a whole set. I have to get back over here. These are rather pretty. Look, they're blue and white. Okay, there's only two. And they, they have the flower inside as well. I think I might have to have these. Oh. Hmm. Not super quality, but they're blue and white. <laughs> oh, I can't see a price. No price. Oh. Mm. Only four cups for that set. That's 10 euros, I presume it's in the set. Four cups. Teapot. Jug. Sugar. Oh. It means I can't focus on it. <laughs> oh, I think it said PL. Yes, it does. What is a beautiful set there. Now, that is plates, bowls, teapot, 
sugar bowl, milk jug, cups and saucers. Wow, one, two, three, one, two, three, four. Another three over there. Ten cups and saucers. There's terrines. There's even a little jug to put your flowers in. Serving plates. Oh, it's an absolutely huge set, but I can't see the price. Oh, 75 euros for 81 pieces. And the bowl's not marked. The cups are. And this little dinky jug. Limon France, so I don't think it actually goes with the set, but it suits it perfect. Less than a euro per piece. Or was even a gravy boat matching? God, that's a big lump of glass, that one. 23 euros for that glass. Now these, that's an unusual design, these are 45 euros for 58 pieces. Unfortunately no marking. Not even on the cup. I'm rather liking this one, it's very colourful. France, Capri. I can't read the signature. And there is no, no price. That's an unusual design. Like ferns. That's it. Yeah, that looks like the I can't read it, can you? Oh, yeah, look, the Irish France. Yeah, Ray Nard and. What's that? Ray Nard. I like that. Oh, 50 euros for. I don't know. Oops, it'll be that and that and that. That's quite a lot of money, so it must be. Must be expensive porcelain. Oh, there's a, 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 a gravy jug as well. But it's not. No. That's quite cute with the little cow, wasn't it? Isn't it? Hasn't actually got anything. It's only 5 euros for the two. They're oh, rather sweet, aren't they? Yeah, unfortunately, um, apart from those those plates with no price on them, I'm not really tempted by anything much today. Oh, look, there's a silver fish. <laughs> and a very faint. Oh, that's quite a big set, look. There's some more... Can you see what that says? Because I can't. It's very faint. No, it's very faint. Too faint for me. Oh, I'm trying to zoom in. Ah. Oh. Oh. I'm upside down. <laughs> always. How do I manage it? I have a 50-50 chance and I always manage it upside down. France something. Uh, Too faint for me. Oh, God. Fillers. I don't know. Fillers and Bach, maybe. Is that a French? Yeah. But there's no price on that either. There's quite a lot of these plates and a few bowls and a big serving terrine and plate. No price. Gross that one, isn't it? Look uh, at those lampshades. Some of the lucky. <laughs> Someone thought it was lovely, didn't they, when they <laughs> made them lampshades? 45 euros, I don't think so. Not for me. Oh. Oh, uh, what works of art have we got today? Same ones I've seen a lot of before. Now, ah, what is this? View of the Cape of Port Jackson. That's quite an old print. Okay, and everything I've picked's got no price on. He's rather nice. I don't like the frame, but he's rather nice. What are they all? Yeah, Cavalier. Yeah, it's fine, isn't it? I mean, it's a, a, yeah, it's a print that's been framed up, but it's very dated frame. Oh, I wonder what chateau that is. There's two pictures there. Oh, 
I can knock on with that shut out the house, loss, this. Oh, anyway, if anybody recognises it, there's two pictures there. That mirror's been there forever because it's all broken. I've seen that so many times, that mirror. Since it's broken, obviously nobody wants to buy it. But they don't seem to reduce things when they don't sell. Like we would in the UK. Oh, I think she was here last time we came as well. What looks like pencil drawing. What's this one? Oh, a religious one. Precious souvenir. Oh, the faithful friend, who's that? We've been to so many Brockhans this week, we haven't bought a lot, have we? Although we've seen a lot of interesting things. Again, these trumpets and things have been here forever. I don't seem to want to sell one. I wonder if that's hand painted. It's only 18 euros. That feels like it actually. What's up, Tracy? Um, it's just a jar, isn't it? A storage jar, maybe. Is it one of these ones, is it? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, it's a bit like, you know, you have the ones that sort of sit on this side. It's quite a nice colour actually. Isn't it? It's like yellow yeah. Yellowy goldy. I know you and your yellow. Yeah. <laughs> Seven euros. Put your sweeties in. Yeah. It's rather nice, but it must have it must have the f offset flat surface in. Yeah, it has. So yeah, it's meant to look like that. Maybe part of the set at some time. So what a beautiful colour. It's nice, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, uh, I quite like the um, candle light bar actually, so not the price on it. No. Yeah, it is actually. And the back. Oh, 25. 25. Right, okay. Well, yeah, it's quite nice. It's not old though. It's nice though, isn't it? Yeah. Huge great uh, decanter, glass, spell, I suppose that's a nice bucket. These must have been a lot of money. Very air. Uh, De Bindor. Probably a very famous glass maker. They look like really good quality, they're really heavy. But yeah, very 70s. Sussex glasses, 30 euros for the set. I'm not sure if it was meant to be a stopper. Big colour for everything's. Uh, Are they real? That one isn't. I think that one is. Ooh. Yeah, that one unfortunately is. So is this. Oh, there's more. I need a hat to keep me warm, but I'm not sure about any of those. Certainly don't want a furry one. Oh, don't look up. Oh. <laughs> 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 
Oh, I missed He's that. Black one He's forgot his pants. Dan, what's going on here? I don't know. The police have got a boat. So I want right. Okay. Two Tonys have managed to get the gate open at the side of the middle house. But there's a lot of things in the way. <laughs> Tracy, go for it. Go on, oh get that gate open. God. Go for the other side. Some treasure. Some treasure? All right, I've been told if I go around through the other side, there's some treasure. So I'm going to go around and have a look. Equally so, we're a little bit interested in what's going on over here because there's a police or a gendarme's vehicle and another gendarme's vehicle or the fireman's vehicle with a boat attached and they appear to be going to put it in the river. So I'm very intrigued as to what's going on. So, can we go and have a look? So your paint's gone to see. Have they found something in the river? Um, so we have some people with their waders on. I'm not sure if there's been a flood or something. I think these are the pompiers with the red van. And they've gone to that end of the river. Around the bend so we can't see them. Hmm, who knows. And yeah, they're definitely looking at something over there in the river. We'll zoom it in. Not really. Maybe it's just something that's blocked up the river and someone's had a flood. Someone else has turned up in a red jeepy thing. And there's still people in the water. I don't know what he's doing. What he's got in his hand, I can't see what he's got in his hand. Not sure. Some sort of plunger. No, I think it's the is doing something. Oh, it looks like an oar. Oh dear, Mr. Gendarme's caused the traffic jam now. Parked his vehicle there and the truck can't get past, so now he's got to move it. <laughs> oh no, he's guiding him through. Okay. So if he doesn't hit anything, particularly the policeman's car. Yeah. Oh. Oh, exciting things are going on here. He's telling him to go. Yeah. <laughs> oh well. Aren't we nosy? I'd love to know what they're up to. They're obviously trying to get something out of the river. Oh, there's a man coming back. Wading back. Another one going round there now. Oh. Someone wading back. If the problem's resolved. Hmm. Ooh, a little bit of drama going on. Oh. He's moved it now. <laughs> He's given up trying to guide them through. Wasn't a very clever place to park it, was it? Never mind. Yeah, is he going to get past the boat and the van? Yeah, there's a bigger space there. <laughs> Yeah, they've all gone now. Uh, right, anyway, can we come back to filming in here? We've never been through this gate, oh! Oh look, Tony's got in. Are we going this side or are we going around the other side? Well, what about for you 
get past here, Jane. It's all twiggy and yucky. Right, let's go around the other side. Oh, is this the treasure? No. Where'd you get that from? Do you know what, though, Jane? They could have been a murder weapon. Oh, don't. We've just seen all the gendarmes. Now we've found some knives. Well, Mind you, they've they... been there a long time. Yeah, but... Not that long, look. Actually, they don't look... Well, because like, they would be stainless steel, they actually look perfectly usable steak well, knives. Is there, a, is there the rest of the set there, Tone? <laughs> <laughs> I could do with some new steak knives. You said there was treasure. Is there treasure up the other end? Yes. Come on. Right, let's go up the other end. Uh -huh. Ooh, come on, Tracy. The intrepid explorers are going around the other side. Nosy. <laughs> Nosy, yeah. <laughs> right, today I'm going to make us some tandoori chicken. So I thought I'd show you because it's a really simple thing to do if you've never tried it. 